This problem is about matching of system and their responses. Match the items in column A with the corresponding items in column B. So pure dead time, pure capacitive, inverse response, first order system with unit gain. And column B we have uh, phase angle equal to minus 90 and a transfer function uh, and uh, 0 to uh, always AR within 0 and 1 and AR of 1. Phi denotes the phase shift and K1, K2 are the process gains, tau the time constant and A are the amplitude ratio. So we need to match these P and uh, always column A with column B for the corresponding elements. So always most of the things are related to uh, frequency response, always these are all related to frequency response. First we will saw, um, we'll first we will match the correct uh, thing. Uh, yeah, here. Mm, the frequency response of pure dead time system which is given as uh, this uh, transfer function is given as g of s equal to uh, e power minus tau ds uh, and uh, e power minus tau ds for which ar is equal to 1 and phase angle equal to minus tau d omega so this ar equal to 1 which matches or is, this is the option 4 for this p and 4 are the matching Likewise, next one is pure capacitive process, pure capacity system. For pure capacity system, G of S equal to Kp by S and AR is given as Kp by omega and phase angle equal to minus 90, which is a constant. So, phase angle is minus 90, which matches for the pure capacity. Whereas, Q and 1 are matching, Q and 1 are matching. Then, first order system with unit gain. So for a first order system with unit gain, transfer function is given as 1 by tau ps plus 1. So AR is given as 1 by root of tau square omega square plus 1. Uh, and uh, phase angle is tan inverse of minus tau p omega. So this AR ranges from initial arrays for omega tending to 0, AR is uh, simply equal to 1. And omega tending to infinity, uh, this, uh, this will be. Uh, this AR will be simply equal to 0. So, otherwise, AR changes from 1 to 0. AR changes from 1 to 0. Otherwise, AR is within 0 to 1. So, otherwise, this option 3 and uh, this yeah, S and 3 are matching. So, S and 3 are matching. So, already we have matched 3 systems and left with is only 1. Otherwise, we can simply say this is equal to inverse response till We'll try to prove that. So for an inverse system, inverse response, we, the requirement is system with positive zero. Or is uh, zero is nothing but the uh, uh, numerator term. So we will write this in numerator by denominator form um, as a single transfer function, or is, which is now having two transfer functions. So k1 into tau s plus 1 and uh, k2 into s divided by this thing. So now we have uh, we can rewrite this in zero form. Otherwise, uh, we need what we need is we need to have s minus uh, z one in the numerator. Otherwise, this would be written as s minus z say r z one for the case of zero or one. So uh, uh, yes, always numerator we have to write it as s minus z equal to zero form. So what is written is. Uh, so this is the numerator terms so we can rearrange them and we, do, we are getting as s equal to k1 by k2 minus k1 tau uh, so this is nothing but uh, this is of the form or uh, we need to write of the form s minus z equal to 0 so here there is the 0 z is equal to this is our uh, 0 uh, for positive 0 uh, this has to be uh, what is it positive so always s equal to uh, z1 this z1 should be positive so for positive z otherwise this content should be greater than 0 uh, so otherwise we can write it as k1 by uh, always uh, we can uh, take this to other form other side so this k2 uh, yeah, let's say for this to be greater than uh, this to be uh, positive for z one to be positive, uh, th this is also to be positive. Mm -hmm. So uh, how to make this to be positive? 
otherwise this k2 should be greater than tau k1 then only this uh, denominator term will be positive so uh, of course k1 is a positive thing and this should be a positive this also should be positive so for that k2 should be greater than tau k1 so uh, k that is already given now k2 should be greater than tau k1 so otherwise this is this system is having a inverse response under the condition of k2 greater than tau k1 so this r and 2 are matching r and 2 are matching so otherwise uh, the whatever the answer options matches well with the d that is d corresponds to p4 pure dead time uh, ar equal to 1 q equal to 1 pure capacitive phase stack equal to minus 19 and uh, r2 inverse response this uh, system is showing inverse response or is it, it possesses a positive 0 under, under the condition of this one and first order system with unit gain for which amplitude ratio is between 1 to 0 for omega 0 uh, ranging from 0 to infinity okay this option is d thank you